going on guys? My name is a Clive Killer. I hope you're having a killer day. And in today's video, I'm going to show you a fix for the Star Wars Battlefront 2 glitch, which causes the game to close back down to the windows. And this this method's very different. Well, it's not very different, but it's different to the other ones which don't work. Like the other ones, I tried them all, they don't work. So this one's completely different. And I found this out when I was just playing around the other day trying to fix the game because I recently just bought it and it wouldn't work. So to, to do this, I'm just going to show you what the glitch is, what the, the, the bug, how it closes down, and then I'll showcase it. So now quickly I'll show you what happens when you're in the game. So now the fix to fix this, uh, you have to go to where the Steam files to the game are installed. And if you don't know where they are, I'll show you in a sec, but if you still can't find them from there, if you head to your properties on your game by right clicking on it, you can head to local files and you can move the install folder to wherever you like. So, but I, but I already know where they are and I'll tell you where most of your guys will be. So you just want to head to your, your hard drive that it's installed on and uh, head down to the program, program files 86, head into that and then find Steam there it is, and then find Steam Apps, then head and then head into the game, Star Wars Battlefront, and then go to Game Data. So now, you wanna, that, that should be the game, I don't know why it's gone to that color, but that's the game there, the Battlefront 2 game. Instead of going to that one, you want to head into the Test App, and just double click on that. So I had to switch back to my phone, because for some reason it wasn't recording the, uh, the, when I went into the game, so if you just go into the test app, it should work this time. It should load up a lot quicker. Last time for me, it uh, took like a couple minutes to even get to this screen, and then the game was kind of really laggy. But uh, so once you're here now, it should be really fast, and you can this time it should work. So if you just add these maps, uh, that one's not working. So add the maps and then launch it. And it should work. As you can see, this time it didn't crash, and you'll be able to play the game. And just for proof, here we go. We're actually in here playing as the CIS. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I hope this helped you, and I also hope to see you in the next video. So I've moved to my phone because when I try and do this, this stuff's recording up because my computer basically crashes. So you notice that it might be a lot slower when you're on this version of the game, the one you go into from your Steam. So you just say you go into a random, a random game, you go and launch it, and then it crashes back to your desktop, kind of thing like that. So now I'm going to show you the exact fix into this, but this glitch can be quite frustrating if you paid good money for the game. Like, it was very frustrating to me until I found this, because I spent probably two hours trying to fix it. Then I finally got it, and I was just like, hell yeah. So I'm going to share that with you, so let's get into it.